Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. It's me, Rowdy, and I hope you all liked my last video. I had a lot of fun doing that video. As I completely forgot what my last video was. Um, I don't remember if it was a World War One battle. No, it was a World War Two battle. It was a battle of Manchuko or whatever. But here we got, we have a World War One, as you can see with the Lewis gun and the British Mark III rifle. Going up toe to toe against German de forces, German forces. I, I was gonna say Germany forces, but you know I got stumbled. Germany has World War One style helms. There was unfortunately no mod. Um, there was a Kaiserreich mod which I could have used, but it crashed my game as soon as I tried to play. So and I already had this set up. But basically, um, yeah, these soldiers are all here, and they're all prepared to fight. Um, let me move you so that you're in a better position. And might as well move you as well. Oh, did not mean to move you, I meant to move you. Save that. And there's no tanks, even though the mission's called tanks, but whatever. There are some mines that I am going to scatter a few more around just for a simple fact that I don't think there's nearly enough. That's fine. Um, the British have a huge numeral like superiority. Uh, let's put them on the retreat, and we're just going to hit start. I'm going to have to go into slow-mo. Um, but yeah. Let's go over to German equipment. So Germans have rifles. They're carbiners, but they're basically gear with us, pretty much. Um, they also have the machine pistol 808, I think it is. Whatever the machine gunner was, or at least the closest thing I could find to it, it's the it's really the Vickers. And it does have a huge advantage. It doesn't need to reload nearly as often as these do. Let me find it. The Lewis guns, right? Um, and uh, they're a lot more. How do I say it? They're a lot more accurate. <coughs> However, I'm still really, really excited to see the Lewis guns. So, um, uh, I used the finished DLC to add the Stonghelms if you're interested. I used a uh, rifle for and edited the helmets so they have helmets for a time and give them the Mark III rifle. Machine gunners, I did just machine gunners, give them the backpack on the back of the rifle for and give them the Lewis gun. I wasn't going to give these as artillery, but they really should not need it. Machine guns are firing, I think. Yeah, they're firing. Seems that neither side is taking any damage. I'm gonna stay on the side of Germany just so we can see the bombs, the mines. Um, the Germans are in hold position. They cannot leave if they wanted to. Uh, all units have one grenade. So, yeah, some use may get caught running like this guy for some reason. Oh, we have our first casualties of the battle. See? And if we're lucky, this guy will trigger... No, he won't. I'll say this guy will hopefully trigger that landmine over there, uh, making it slightly easier for the British. Um, and a surprise... I'm ne I've played this battle a lot, like, while I was... Um, how is it? I played this battle a lot, I would say. I've never looked at it, but I have done tons of test runs. I think this is the best way to say it. Um, did, is that a machine gun? Yeah, it is. We've had a few machine gunner deaths. I think once the main British force comes up, um, things are going to be a lot more difficult for them. And for them, I mean the Germans. Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. Germany still has the machine guns, but still. Oof. Oof, that would have been a good shot if I caught the rifle shooting. Oh! First grenade goes off. Killing uh, three rifles. This guy, I think, died from rifles or machine gun fire. I want to add artillery, however... Do you know how many soldiers they were and how clumped up they were? I didn't want to 
ruin it, you know? Let's do one, one artillery and like completely destroy, destroy this. And also, I think I would call, I would draw the line for historical inaccuracy as soon as it gets to artillery. There's not really that many good art pieces of artillery. And the artillery that I would use are extremely overpowered. It's like one shot, like it kill like everyone in here. I prefer the bullets in this case scenario. Artillery's finicky, if if I really have to say it. Um, the Germans need to keep up and keep firing. They've done they've done tons of damages over here. Um, and I do. This is only the first line. This guy over here just keep on firing into the crowd. The landmines. Okay. All right. I'm gonna make this guy run up and do his civic duty. Nice. Well, he had a sacrifice. He sacrificed himself so that no other soldiers would get killed. He probably saved one or two of his comrades there. Here, just to troll them a tad bit. If you move, you're dead, bro. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Anyway, let's go back to just looking at the German side. The Germans have taken their first casualties of the battle as the British soldiers are moving forward. Uh, things will get bloody fast in the German trenches now that they're actually making some way into. Have you gotten any kills? You're a machine gunner. It makes sense. No, but you have taken some damage. I will say the magic about these trench battles is... Oh, like these mass assaults is no matter how many soldiers you send in and how many captures you take, you, they always seem to have way more. See, that guy just died. Yeah, I think that guy's going to die as well. Okay, so two more casualties, and these guys are pretty much sort of dead, I would say. There's only a few soldiers over here that I would say are safe from being evaporated. So, yeah, and I'm pretty sure almost, e oh, almost every German, or at least every machine gunner, has at least one kill. Yeah, I won't see how many kills the most, like the, oh, that guy's dead, that's annoying. Probably the most kills. Look at his positioning. Um, that's not a machine gun. They have a lot, they've killed a lot of machine gunners, I'm realizing. That guy has two kills. Two kills. There was barbed wire, however, I couldn't think of adding, like, however, the um, artillery couldn't pierce the barbed wire, so I really couldn't do anything about it. It seems that the British mass assault has sort of come to an end. And one thing I have, I will say, is the beginning, while there is tons of casualties, they, there's way more once they get up the hill. Oh, and they have their first casualty over here. That's not good. Showing that the Germans up here are not impenetrable. I really just say get up, fire your weapon if you're a rifleman. If you're a machine gun or fire like a burst and then get down. Hmm. Here, let's get. I'm gonna control the ads a bit. Here, you guys trying to just run up like directly at the enemy i know it may be hard for you but like no eh, you'll be fine all right let's go see the mass assault they're about to do 
want to get this as a screenshot potential thumbnail maybe um i can definitely at very least even if this doesn't kill any of them this will at very least draw the attention away up there dude guys gotta get up here bro damn it I wanna see if I can be one of these British soldiers grenade oh that's not good this guy's gonna die I can see it Oh, that would have killed him if I didn't move him. Ah, dude. Oh, you're shitting me. Oh, this guy's dead. Oh, it seems if we're gonna get a break, it's gonna be here. Alright, I'm gonna play this one of the British soldiers. Nice, machine gunner dead. I thought that was a rifleman, that's why I didn't shoot for him immediately. Oh, he's dead. I thought I was gonna get him for sure. Alright. This is the speed if I was going at normal speed. Shit, okay, maybe I should stop. This really does feel like a World War One battle. Okay, this, this, these guys are breaking first. Nice. Oh shit, okay, that was someone. Yep, knew it. Dude, get up. Like the only British person in the trench, and you actually have significant cover. Uh, you got this one right here that has a grenade, right? Alright, grab that. I'll throw it over there. Just got that guy. Just grab the last grenader and throw it over there. Alright, that should kill him. And now with all that stuff broken, um, we can continue up our assault. Set some trips over here. I think more soldiers need to get closer. If you want the witness, we need to get closer. I'm helping out the British. This does not seem like it's in their favor right now. Um, they've taken a few gaps. So mostly the machine gunners I think are getting targeted, which is fair to say. This guy has four kills. Uh, I should have moved him, whatever, it's fine. I'll move there when it's done. Here, give me your... Oh, the machine gunners, of course, don't have a grenade. Alright. Oh, that's useless. Okay, that was actually really First thing he did as soon as they stopped controlling him. Alright, I'm just trying to help out the British. The British really do need this help. Let's do a mass charge at this point. Charge. Alright. What's going on in here? I will say the glory of this mission is feeling like an actual British or German soldier in the trench. Even if it's simple, it's still a fun battle. 
Like, can you survive like a massive charge? Like, you have one grenade, you're by yourself, you gotta do all that shit. I don't know if I could in real life. I, I'd probably die, I'm not that good, but I mean, at the same time, military training. See, so yeah, I'm gonna do this is my last time I'm gonna control this guy, okay? No more controlling after this. I'm gonna try throwing one last grenade over the top, up, and then I'm gonna let this guy go back to doing whatever he wants to do. If I die, the Germans keep their soldiers. If I survive, then. I, yeah. Damn, that's a lot of casualties. Alright, I know exactly where I'm throwing. Should get in, right? Yeah, you're good. Oh, but directly in the trench. It's gonna kill at least a few people. Is there that guy's dead? Oh, killed two people, two riflemen. Would have been better if it killed a uh, machine gunner, but whatever. Now we're just gonna watch the rest of the battle. Wow, this is just from the first trenches alone. Well, I guess they had some fire support up here, but still. This guy's an idiot. Yeah, saw it coming a mile away. These guys over here are causing such a problem for the British over here. These guys are being stuck up because of them. They're way more effective. Uh, are they way more effective? Because, no, nah, I would say they're decently impacted. I might actually die up here. Ooh, how much health are you at, buddy? Six. Oh. I don't even know where that's going, bro. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit, dude. Oh, let's see. Does that kill anyone? That might. Might even trigger the bomb, though. Let's see, does it do anything? Oh, he killed one person. Let me, let me just trigger this bomb over here. All right, now let's actually stop touching that. All right. So these guys up here, they can, s decent amount of caches, I say, casualties. Oh, they've lost two people to the wall. Two machine gunners nonetheless, damn, okay. That's like 20 men's worth of machine gunners there. Can you name 20 people? The assault is still going on, which is pretty good. Just doing some like checks over here. See if I can help out these people on in any way. Cause I still have some um, symp sympathies towards the British. Yeah, I should probably charge up. I will say back here, they don't really have that great of a shot down the hill. Let me see. Let me see if I can be one of these guys. Nice. Nice. Missed. Let's see, can this guy at least kill us? One last guy? Nope, he's, he, these two people are safe. Damn. Alright. 
it. So up here, the Germans are finally getting broken, I would say, after a while. Well, it's only, oh, two people getting into the top. One person led by me, the other one not. What else is either dying over around here or, yeah. Over here, it seems like the Germans are getting finally pushed out of these trenches over here. Yeah. I'm just going to evacuate these guys up here. The Germans were 100% hit on their weak side. Alright, let's get you guys out of here. Can you guys retreat to some more, like, favorable land, uh, right there seems fine. So you can even make it there. Let's see, you, mm, you guys, you guys would not mind if you guys got up there. All right, you guys gotta get out of here. All right, just run, bro. All right, well, these guys are going to retreat. Finally pushing out the um, British. Well, finally being pushed out, these final soldiers are, are opting to escape rather than be killed. I don't think any of them are going to be killed in their retreat. Maybe this guy? I can see this guy dying. Which is sad, he has three kills. He might escape though. Oof. If he escapes, he's going to be on. He's going to use his one revive. Oh. Ooh, oh, and he dies. Unfortunate. Um, let's just get you guys like right up here. Now you'll be fine. We'll get onto the action way faster. Ooh, this isn't good up here. So the Germans are definitely putting up a huge defense. Grenades have to be like really, really clear here. All right. Um. Now you'll serve good there. You'll serve good up here. This guy has three kills, which isn't bad. Three kills, damn. Not good. Let's see if I can survive with this guy. Oof. It's bad. Oh shit. Okay. No, you're dead. It's a machine gunner. Seems like they're coming up the hill. Oh yeah, they're 100 and going up the hill. I don't know if these guys should just fight to the death or retreat. I don't know. Oh, that guy died. That was your last mistake. Oh, I feel terrible sometimes for this. Nice. 
nice landmine. Reload. Um, all right, you guys are the only people left. Yeah, definitely get out of there. You guys can get out of there, and you guys will just regroup for the final attack. As long as these guys don't press. Okay, nice. As long as these guys over here can support their retreat, I'm sure that we're good. All right, the British people. The British, I think. Can come back. All right, this guy needs to heal. Machine gunners are extremely important. All right. Um. Yeah, this would be good. Nice. Oh wow. Oh wow, this might be a German victory. I've never seen this happen before. I'm not joking. I've never seen this happen before. It's every single time it's an overwhelming British person victory. Let's see if I can help the British out just a tad bit. Let me be like one of their useless machine gunners. Oh my god, they suck with only riflemen now? No way, are they really? I mean, they might. Oh my god, I think they are. I think they're stuck with just their, uh, their riflemen. Oh, that's awful. Let me grab this guy's Lewis gun. I'm gonna pretend like it's Battlefield. Nope, that's not need to be reloaded. Oh wow, oh wow, that was really effective. Wow, dude, wow. Alright, this is where, oh shit, okay. You don't charge up a hill, man, when you don't know you're getting it. Oh shit, oh god, that's not good. Oh, oh I was say, there's another British machine gunner. Nice. Now I probably screwed up that grenade. <laughs> Nice, this fast paced trench warfare is what I live for. Too bad there's not that many good trench maps in this game. This is uh, not even in the base game. Ah, shit, okay. Well, I'll let the Germans sit around devices now. Nice. Keep up the defense, bro. You're, you, you don't die, bro. It up. Oh, nice. An actual machine gunner. Oh, God, that might be good. Nice. Machine gunner. How much health does the machine gunner ass? It's doing fine, just not getting any hits. Um, is there a way to put you right here? Ah, I'll be fine. Oh. No, no you gotta go there. Our, uh, the British people are lower amount of numbers, they have lower numbers. You know, I'm gonna call this back as, a, as an un, unneeded retreat. I'm calling this back for a, they don't have the manpower to do this. You guys need to head, you guys head over here. All right, this is a sad failure for the British.
Well, that's unfortunate. And now the British can retreat over here. Let's look at the battlefield. I think it makes more sense for us British, British people officers. British people. I think it's smarter for the British just to retreat instead of be screwed over. But let's look at the casualties. So red is Germans and yellow. I mean, in, no. Red is the British. Yellow is Germans. So as you can see off the bat, this, this mine was even detonated. And, it, and there's all these people dead over here. It sounds like mines where people have exploded. However, I don't think these have killed that many because I didn't make sure to run up and detonate it. Not. That's where it's failing. Oh, you survived. No, you didn't. Um, over here, a lot of mines went off. I think it killed two people. Um, but yeah. Then while they try running up here, I did was like, hey, let's just use shock trooper tactics. If you can go up and kill and bomb these people out, they're eventually killed. And they like they did break through the first trench. I think first trench was definitely a breakthrough. However, up here, the second trench, I think second trench was pretty much a breakthrough. However, they had I'm gonna call this the command post section. Where they held out really well. This guy had six kills. This guy has three. This guy has five. I mean this guy has one, two, I mean four, one, two, everyone up there has a kill, three, zero, six, three, zero, six, zero, one, three, three, two, 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 one, one, six, zero, zero and one so that was all the germans did i check what these guys were i think it, yeah i did and all the british were obviously pushed back i would say this is i would say this is a loss for everyone this feels like no nah, this is just a loss i'd say no one won but here is the overall view i'm gonna do what i do in every video where i mark up sections and say who won and lost over here, the fields, this is a very clear German victory. Um, even if you're just going on by how effective their defenses were, I think they did a pretty good job at, I won't say holding them, but I would say they did do a very good job at inflicting casualties, and that's really what mattered. Over here in the trenches, which is past this, like, which is where the trees, right? I would say sort of a British slash draw, minor British victory, and over here, I'd say we have our first draw slash leaning towards the British, and over here, I would say this is definitely a British victory because of how much they inflicted. However, because they got repelled, I'm not going to count it and just say they lost. 